Good morning PageRagers and welcome back to our PageRage video tutorials. In today's video tutorial we will be showing you how to go about using our Create Your Own Layout tool um, and how to um, use images from our clipout gallery on our new tool. So to get started you'll need to go to PageRage.com You'll also need to install PageRage in order to use our tool. So since I've already installed PageRage, I just can go directly to the Create Your Own Layout tool. And um, in order to use this tool, as I said in the previous video, you will need to be logged into your PageRage user account. So I'm already logged in, as you can see here, so that's why I have um, the ability to use the tool. So um, to get started, um, I will show you how to upload images from our new clip art gallery. Um, I'm going to upload images to the left and right curtains. So um, let's start with the left curtain. You'll just go to click um, add image. And before we added images from our personal computer, today we're going to be adding images from our clip art gallery. So just click on clip art. And um, this is one of the categories that you can choose clip art from. Be sure that you use this drop down menu and you can see all the different categories that we have of clip art. So I'm going to go to love. And I'm going to click on this heart right here. And as you can see, an image of the heart has been added. Now there's a few editing options I can um, use for this specific clip art image. I can decide to size it any way I want. I can make it smaller. I can make it bigger. I can duplicate the image so it makes an exact replica of that image. I can also uh, decide to rotate the image any way I like. So we'll just do that. Um, and I can make the image transparent as well. I can also fade the image if I like, um, but since I've already made the image transparent, I don't really want to use that feature. So now that um, I like this image the way it is, I want to duplicate that image, as you can see here, and let's rotate the opposite way. And let's duplicate the same image again. So I've done the same thing and I don't even need to rotate it. So that is that. So let's not make it as transparent. Okay, so now that I have the images I want on my left curtain, I can also change the color of my left curtain. And to do that, just click on this color box. And let's select a yellow color. A light yellow. So you can, as you can see, I have added clip art images and I've selected a color from my left curtain. Now I want the same exact image to go directly to the right side of um, my profile, and you can do that by selecting this radio button here. And so it makes the direct image to the right side. So you don't even have to, you know, repeat adding images and selecting color, it just moves it to the right side so it looks like an even Facebook layout. So um, now I want to add color to my title bar and to do that I just go to my title bar box, click color and select a color and as you can see there I have my layout and I just utilized our clip art gallery which is pretty cool. So. Um, with this clip art gallery feature, make sure you just go through all the categories, see what we have as options. We'll be adding more clip art um, further down the road um, when we get more images in there for you guys. So just keep checking back. So now that my image is complete or my layout is complete, um, I can choose to select a font color for my profile. Um, I can choose to repeat the layout, which means that the, the curtains on the left and right hand side repeat all the way down. And I can make my profile transparent if I wish as well. So just save the layout. Make sure you name the layout and give your layout keywords so it's easily searchable. Click Finish. And once my layout saves, um, you'll be able to log into your Facebook account. Go to your Profile tab. You may have to hit the Refresh key in order to see the layout and I'll show you right now. So go to my profile tab and there you have it. There's my layout. Stay tuned for more video tutorials on how to use our Create Your Own Layout tool.